not the end. We're still we have a long way to go. Maya Miliete's sister, emotional reaction from the family of South Bay mother Maya Miliete after her husband's arrest. This morning, Larry Miliete is in custody, accused of Maya's murder. And all of this comes more than nine months after she went missing, for nine months. However, Maya's body has still not been found. News 8's Chris Groh is joining us live in Chula Vista with details of this investigation. Some answers, but still so many questions. Good morning to you, Chris. Good morning, uh, Stella and Netta. And look, we do have an idea of where prosecutors are going to be going with this case. A lot of it based on circumstantial evidence. However, Maya's family still pushing to figure out exactly where she is. We're still asking the public, please help us bring my sister home. We will, Mari Chris. We will. I still want to see my sister. <laughs> We're here. We're here. I still want her to come home to us. Maya's sister, Marty Chris, very emotional after that bombshell drop there. And as you can see, Larry in handcuffs being arrested, finally charged with her disappearance and murder. Now, Larry Miliette had already been declared a person of interest, the only one in this nine month long case. Now, District Attorney Summer Stefan believes Maya was in a toxic marriage with her husband. Stefan says Maya called a divorce lawyer on January 7th, the day she most likely disappeared. Since then, though, her body has still not, be, has still not been found. So some are wondering what that means for the case. Now, according to a legal expert that we spoke with, it's not necessarily as big of a roadblock for the prosecution as we might think. According uh, to that person that we spoke with, essentially the circumstantial evidence will just have to play a huge role along with whatever physical evidence they do have. We do know that there are text messages that will be used as well as other evidence such as where the phones went the day that they were declared the day that they believe Maya was last seen during that 11 hour absence and a lot of other factors will go into this as well too without that body. There is case law that we will be using in this case that makes it even more clear that a missing body is circumstantial evidence that there was foul play and that it's a murder because somebody who takes their own life cannot hide their own body. And Larry is due to be arraigned tomorrow. We did hear from his attorney for more on what he had to say. Just go to our website, cbs8.com, and click on the story link. Stella and Netta.